at some point I, he was listening to Richard Dawkins, all his science stuff, read all his books and, and, and loved them. And he tried to share stuff with me, but he wouldn't tell me that there were Richard's ideas. So he wouldn't tell me. So I found out later that I actually knew a lot of stuff from Richard's books, but I didn't know they were his. So mm -hmm. it's kind of funny, but I would, I mean, I told him in the car when he was such a jackass. So he's so arrogant, such an arrogant jackass. And he finally got, he's like, Melissa, just read something by him. So you can actually criticize him for something he's written. And so I picked up the God delusion. He's like, you're going to read that one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, yes, I, I'm just going to read that one. And I read it and I get about, I'm sitting in bed. We're sitting in bed reading and he's got some astrophysics book and I'm sitting there reading the God delusion. And I get about, I don't know, like two thirds of the way through. And I put it down. I said, Tom, I think I'm an atheist. And he was just like, what? <laughs> I mean, the literal jaw drop. Just He could not believe it. What? I was like, have you told Richard the story? Yeah. I, yeah. I have been reading this book and I'm like, Tom, I already think all of these things. And I, I just didn't know what it was called. And that I don't believe any of these things anymore. I'm not a Christian anymore. And I think I'm an atheist. He's like, well, wait, maybe you don't want to go running around and telling people that right away. I'm like, no, I'm an atheist. And he's like, whoa, breaks. <laughs> he was terrified. Because Why breaks? Because... Well, I'm, I'm kind of impulsive sometimes, and he wanted to, like, please don't run out and destroy your family and your life. Like, you know, Let's take this slow, make sure you know what you're thinking. Uh. But I finished it, and I was like, I was, it was amazing because it was so freeing to realize, like, w what I what I was, right? I mean, or, or mm. where I was, rather, mm. that I just didn't believe anymore. I just didn't realize it. I had so you found it liberating to be able to call yourself an atheist. Yeah. Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim majority countries advocating for atheists, secularists, and enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.